But just like some of those things, like we were just showing you a brief uh, demonstration of the shears that are coming up. They're must-haves. They're things that you have to have in your kitchen to do the things you want to do. What you're looking at is an angled turkey baster and a four-cup fat separator. Now, you may have a turkey baster already, but it's 74 years of age, and your grandmother had it. It is time to update and have something that really works. I want to introduce you to Kate Lumineski. Yes. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. This is modern brilliance in engineering. It is so simple. Every little fact and feature about this, you look at and go, well, that's what OXO is all about. Why didn't we think of this before? OXO is all about the thoughtful details. We're all about taking a kitchen product or kitchen tool uh -huh. and making so that it works beautifully, you're delighted by the results, and sometimes we come up with some clever ideas in, in the uh, development process. Come on over process. here, because so, we're going to talk about Thanksgiving. Right, so and, there's two tools besides yep. the turkey that you absolutely need for Thanksgiving. Okay. A turkey baster yep. and a fat separator, because you don't want greasy gravy and you want a nice, crisp, juicy turkey. Most people don't have a fat separator. You know, you can do things like try to skim it with a spoon, but that works. doesn't really work because you can't get that curved surface under a flat surface and when yep. you're in a roasting pan. So the fat separator, you just basically take and pour all of your pan drippings and all of your all uh -huh. of your juice. And what happens is the fat will rise to the top and the good gravy, which is what you want on the bottom, uh -huh. is gonna stay on the bottom and then you can pour it out very easily. Down here at the bottom, this is all the flavor. This is all the flavor. This, this is, is what's what been roasting juicy, and browning, yeah, and, yeah. and you've got the meat flavor and the vegetable flavor. What we realize, though, is one of the pain points in the process is when you have a fat separator, you get liquid that goes into the spout. Uh -huh. And as it separates, you'd end up with kind of fat on the top and, yep. and gravy on the bottom. So you'd have to pour off the fat, let it resettle, and then start all over again. So one of our engineers during this development process realized that if we change the air pressure that was in this spout right here, uh -huh. you can see what happens. As I move this in and out, the liquid actually never enters the spout until I take this silicone plug and I remove it. Right. And what you get in the spout is only that good gravy. Just the good stuff. Just the good stuff. Is that brilliant? <laughs> now, we, this is featured priced at $19.98. Uh, I had the pleasure of working with Kate when she first came to QVC yes. uh, in our, our training program. But this is the first chance I've had to really work with you. Yes. And everything about this is truly innovative. Thanksgiving can be the most frustrating dinner of the entire year. It can be delightful. It but can be. It can be a stressful yeah. process to get to that beautiful family dinner at the very end with everybody around and everybody happy. We want to make that experience in the kitchen as delightful as eating. Well, do you, do you want to show them this I as would well? love to show you. So it's not just a fat separator that you get. You also get this baster. And one of the special features about this baster is one, it's angled. So as you're reaching into the oven, you don't want to take the turkey out of the oven because then all the cold, all the hot air escapes from the oven. Yeah. You want to be able to baste inside the oven. So this angled surface allows you to get around to the back of the baster and points it down to the turkey instead of spattering it on the walls. Okay. It also has a little foot. Which, by the way, every other turkey baster you lay on the counter mm -hmm. and you wind up mopping up or, afterwards. Or it kind of rolls away, yes. right? And you, you get the tip and everything gets greasy. This just kind of tips it up so everything goes back into the, into the baster. And I know that seems like such a simple approach appliance, but they engineered it to the point where you cannot over squeeze it. You'll never draw gravy or fat right. up into the you bulb. You don't want to burn your hands, right? So the capacity of this bulb is such that if you completely squeeze it and suck in as much liquid as you possibly can, it, it will go. never yep. overfill, so you won't burn your hands. Easy to clean, easy to take yes. care of. Dish Let, everything is dishwasher Let's show them space. how to pour off some gravy, Okay. and we'll, we'll show them exactly how it works. Okay, so you want to take this yep. and pour you it ready? into here. Is this now. hot? No, you're good. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Now, I've got... Let me, you want me to bring this... Yeah, bring that over there if you okay. don't mind. There we go. And we've got all the good stuff in here, too. Right. We've got vegetables, etc. And the whole idea here is that it is designed so that you don't have to worry about things spilling. You don't have to worry about mess. You don't have to worry about cleanup. Now, you can see there's a strainer that's built into this, um, into this fat separator. That strainer right. is removable. So that's going to catch all the little bits and pieces you can see right here. Okay. Do you want to put that some? <laughs> yeah, I'll put this underneath. We're okay. fine. So that strainer is going to catch all those bits and pieces and, and the onions and, and the carrots you. and things like that, right? That's, that's the stuff that you don't want mixing with your gravy. Now you can see the fat is starting to separate. And if you let it rest for a little bit, you'll end up with something that looks a lot like this. Yes. That's kind of the before. Yeah. We're doing this in TV time. Because the fat rises to the top, and you've got that layer of liquid that's on the top here, and then you have all that good stuff underneath. Now, if you'll look, we've got measurement markings that show you exactly how much. So if you're a cook that likes to cook with a recipe, like yes. I like to know exactly what my measurement should be. So you can say, okay, one and a half cups of liquid, you can measure it out here. Now watch again, when you take this out, that changes the air pressure in the spout. You don't have any fat. You don't have you to worry about gravy. pouring it off. And now, OXO is designed, 
I was kidding around about how grandmom's got a turkey baster that she's had for 70 years. OXO, everything is such quality that you'll have it for a generation or more. Now, the I want you to notice. Oh, yep, sorry. The gradations don't come off in the dish. Right. She is pouring just pure gravy. Just that pure, beautiful no stuff. No fat. One of the things you'll notice, this is very unusual, but this is curved up at the top. Okay. We did that because we want you to be able to get all that delicious liquid out of the, the bottom. Good stuff. But what we noticed during our testing is sometimes you're so focused on what's happening down here, you end up slopping fat over, over the, the top, top and over pouring I've it. I've done it. So it has this nice rim over here, so you can't actually over pour it. So you can get all that up, oh, there comes the fat, and then I'm done pouring. And it's we're talking about your dinner. This is a gift for someone who is a foodie, whether they've been cooking forever or mm -hmm. the young lady you and I were talking to, yeah. uh, my makeup artist, this is her first Thanksgiving. She doesn't have a baster and she doesn't have a fat separator, yeah. which we're gonna gift to her later. Yes, <laughs> but what this will do is help you and assist you, and that's, that's what tools in the kitchen mm -hmm. are for. Grandma didn't have this, your mother didn't have this. Well, this is brilliant in every way. So you'll notice now on this on this turkey baster here, Uh huh. How it's you can so see, easy you to can get see the, how yeah. she's pouring that that liquid right over. That makes that crispy surface. It makes the skin nice and brown, but it keeps the turkey on the inside nice and juicy. That's yeah. what that basting is for. And these are little secrets, Mom. Now mm -hmm. that uh, I was joking around before this year at Thanksgiving, we're, my wife and I are just going to invite the fire department yeah. <laughs> because they wind up showing up anyway. <laughs> first, the first turkey that my wife and I ever cooked. Uh, forgot to remove the little plastic bag mm. with the giblets and everything else, and. So many What's of that you have delicious scent of burning plastic? <laughs> oh, it was horrific. <laughs> but mom knew it's the basting of the turkey that made it perfect. Yep. And now we're talking about cleanup that's easier than ever before. This is on the air for $19.98. And you get a brush to clean everything. And you get a brush to clean everything. It's such a nice pleasure to have you with us. Thanks Thank for being you. Here. It's right now about, what, 31 minutes.